just kick back, relax, because we got another all-star game. What to do, players and trainers? It is your boy, the Blazing Squid. And we got Kaz Beast and Alejandro. Who's repping who? I'm pretty sure Alejandro's repping our squad. Team Medium, no, Team Long Schlong. We are Team Long Schlong. And then, no, my dog will not bark on the door. And then we have Bat Kyle. Oh, uh, yeah, Bat Kyle, who was not an EVO or a LDL coach, but we were having a little bit of fun. We said, hey, man, you can compete too. And we gave him, um, if I'm not mistaken, this was Ratty Blue Wiz team. Stop. Chida. So this is Res Ratty Blue's team, and he's going to be taking over. And he's going to be repping Team Medium Salon. I'm going to double check that for you guys. But I'm pretty sure that's how it went down. But looking over the team. Yeah, he's repping Team Medium Salon. So, um, look at Alejandro's team. Alejandro's rocking with the... Remember, he was undefeated in EVO. So, this is a powerful team. Um, and I'm not sure how bad Kyle played. But this is a Rain team. Rain is pretty hard to prep with. And he's bringing Vocal Rona. He's bringing Vocal Rona. We got Crobat. We got Mesprit. We got him on Lee. And with the Tabu Fini, so we're expecting some type of seed. I think probably like a Misty Seed or something, I think it's called. And then Electivire. Um, so some pretty, like, not too, 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 like, super up there mods, but a pretty solid team with Synergy. And then back out, we'll be ringing that rain team with Louis Colo, Kingdra, Kung Kelder, Florges, Jolteon, and Pelipper. So how this match is going to go out, uh, I'm excited to find out. Let's jump into this match. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's see what happens, players and trainers. And once again, guys, remember, uh, the link will be down below if you guys want to know so far all the battles and how how, how the All-Star Week is going and who's in the lead and whatnot. But Crobat's going to start off, and so will Jolteon. So both 130 tier mons of speed going at it. Are they both going to U-turn? Oh, Morrigan is going to go out first and U-turn. Uh, is this Scarf? We don't know yet. We don't. You know who does know? Bat Kyle does know. Hidden power. Ice? Has to be. Has to be. That was a good uh, was a good read though. I, I'm gonna admit that was a good read there. Um Conk is gonna come out here though. This is why this man went undefeated. <laughs> this is why this man went undefeated. <laughs> oh. That was just, oh. That was golden. That was golden. Oh my god. No. I don't, I don't know if he could have made a better read than that. I don't. That was golden, man. That was golden indeed. No special, no special attack drop, so that's nice. So, so, so now you can start setting up some quiver dances, and um, I don't think too much can affect him. If he gets two quiver dances up, he's looking really, really nice. Oh, he's actually, oh, he's gonna bait in the pelipper. Is that it? Ooh, that's really, really solid if he does. That's really solid if he does. Oh man. Just kick back, relax. This is oh, this is a match and a half, my dudes. What a game so far, man. Oof, I, I'm excited. I'm excited. Like you guys, I'm, I'm, I'm speechless. Actually, I'm speechless. I not 100 sure what was with that switch there, man. Really not sure what was that switch in there. Um. The only thing he has for the thing is Chalteon too, actually. So Giga Drain, let's see how much that does. Eh, it's about 30%, I would say. Z move, Water Tyrion, Z. Yo, these guys are just throwing Z moves like it's nothing at each other, man. Sheesh. Whoa. 
All right, so Hydro Vortex coming off. About to do some real damage here. If this does not kill, I'll be shocked. I can tell you that much. No, that kills. That just straight up kills. All right, so it's not it's not over yet. It's not over. Louis Colo could put in a lot of work here. Uh, Zen comes in this thing and gets activating no seed. It's a normal gem set. Okay. See how much that does. That's actually a good chunk of damage. That's a really solid chunk of damage. Close combat is gonna come off. Uh, I think Ludicolos is just like seven. Did that crit matter? I don't, I'm not sh Hold up, hold up, did that crit matter? Did that crit matter right there? I don't think so because of how much normal, well, normal gen boosted it. No, I don't, I'm not sure. If, if this thing was a quick fee set, it probably would have been better. I don't know. Ugh, him on Lee versus uh, la 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 Louis Colo. I'm trying to see if that close combat mattered. It does not matter if he's adamant. Because of the damage it did. I think he just realized that Pelipper was his better switching. He doesn't have Hurricane? Who needs Hurricane when Scald kills with a crit? But it's... I don't... Oh, he has what? Probably Florges and something else in the back? Well, yeah, he could have gone into Florges too, actually. Thinking about it now. Because... I'm pretty sure Florges would have taken a Quiver Dance. Oh, I think... I think... Kaz Beast just played this a little, a little bit too bad. A little bit. A little bit bad because the sense you have Florges, you do have, um, you know, to be told, the close combat was kind of, I'm not sure if it was obvious, but like, well, no, no, he couldn't risk it because if he went for Poison Jab, uh, that would have been neutral on, on both ends there. So, okay, okay, it makes sense, makes sense. Still, I think Florges should have been the switch in, not Jolteon when when he did, um, just because it would have prevented him. Like keeping a, a healthy Jolteon would have been helpful since his opponent still does have the top of Finney. Uh, he does have the Electivire, but it's it's like probably at 60%. But let's see, it's gonna keep Quiffer dancing here. I, I guess he just wants, if, if Alejandro doesn't have Hurricane, I'll be shocked. To tell you the truth, I'll be shocked. But I think he will. Either that or have like a hidden power, a hidden power electric. Let's find out which of the two. Another Quiver Dance. Okay. This man might be getting a little greedy. Might. Unless he has nothing for it. That can also be a thing. He's eating that up pretty well, though. Hopefully, now you attack. Okay, so he does have the Hurricane. Hurricane should knock this thing out. Uh, Pelipper, never mind, does not knock it out. And there's another crit. Wow. So what, dude? Man, that sucks. That really does suck because Alejandro could have been walking away here with the 4-0. I'm pretty sure almost. Yeah, he could have been walking away with the 4-0. Instead, that crit is gonna come in the benefit of a Kaz Beast. I think this is why they call him the Kaz Beast. Team of the. I don't know. What is this team's name? Let me see, what is this? What is this team's name? The Mesa City Machamps, that's what it is. Versus the Lakewood Trivenant. Uh, pretty X Scissor here, Cross Poison. X Scissor, come on, Squid. That's, that's, come on, he lives. Are you gonna Wisp stall with Protect right now? No, come on, Bat Kyle. Was that called the Cat? What is his real name? Is it Bat Kyle or is it Kaz Beast? Who cares? Because the beard just shaved you off your beard. Or that, that was bad. That was horrible. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, players and trainer. But Team Long Shlong is gonna take another W here. I don't think Pelipper can do anything at this point. Um, and this probably is a scarfed thing. It's either scarf or he has the Wakan beard. I want to say one of the two. One of the two. But 
Alejandro, congratulations on your win. Team Long Shlong, another congratulations on your win. Keep winning. Uh, I'm hoping for it because I... Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? But the results, once again, players and trainers, will be down below. You guys are amazing. Stay amazing. and catch you guys in the before or the next video. Who knows? Who? Let's go. Let's go.